People who use a park on the Hamilton Mountain are calling on the city to address a drainage issue. Certain sections are covered in pools of water, and it's not the only park with this issue. Eric Fiano reports. A resident sidesteps a large puddle at Eleanor Park today on what should be a relatively dry walk with his dog. Seems they've uh, developed uh, a bit of an issue with standing water here, which is becoming a bit of a hazard, especially in the cold weather. It's uh, turning into ice. Hamilton's manager of parks and cemeteries, Kara Bunn, says the city is aware of the issue. We've seen a lot of rain and changing weather patterns, and um, this is a result of that. Now, some people I spoke to who walk in the area say that certain sections of the park are worse than others, like this section right here where there's a large puddle of water. They say it's been like this for a long time. Some days it's so flooded here that they can't even walk through this section of the paved path. People actually avoid it. Uh, there's lots of water over there and it is a concern. Being that it was a wet uh, fall, especially early December there, it's been standing water here for a couple months anyways. And if you look to the left of the path up there, you'll see almost a, a pond up there and that hasn't disappeared in months. The city says Eleanor Park isn't the only one with this issue. We have others like Millgrove Park. Uh, we're currently working on a drainage solution there. Bunn says when some of the parks in the city were built, they were not designed to manage and maintain the amount of water the city has been seeing lately. We really didn't anticipate the climate change uh, measures and what was, was going to be happening in the city as far as the amount of rainfall and uh, the fact that we'd have more rain and less snow. Um, these are all things that we just we didn't see coming. The city says it recently spent $150,000 on small proactive measures to address the issue at Eleanor Park. Our project was just to replace the asphalt paving and we replaced it in the same location with the same material. We made sure that we put some some extra drainage um, pits and things like that in there, but they haven't been enough to deal with as much water as is sitting there. Bunn says the city is currently working to address the design of the park, but could not provide a specific timeline. Eric Vieno, CHCH News, Hamilton.